Today, field books reported that there were steam-laden plumes rising 800 meters high before drifting southwest. So for dioxide, emission was measured at an average of 97 tons per day on February 1, 2020. Ayan. So nakikita niyo po ang mga ayan, mga usok ano, sa Taal Volcano. And Taal Volcano Seismic Monitoring Network recorded 134 volcanic earthquakes during the 24-hour observation period including one low-frequency event. Two of these events at 4.20 a.m. and 5.42 a.m. registered respectively at magnitude 3.2 and 2.3. The first having been felt at intensity 4 in Laurel and Agoncillo, intensity 3 in Lemery, Batangas, and intensity 2 in Tagaytay City. These earthquakes signify magmatic activity beneath the Taal edifice that could lead to eruptive activity at the main crater. Ayan. So, yan. So, you can see, uh, this one is overlooking Taal Volcano. Tagaytay. Yeah. Please like, comment, and share this video. You can also click the bell button for more information and updates. Please subscribe now, mga kaibigan, mga kababayan. So you can see the beautiful Taal Volcano still, but uh, today it's cloudy and uh, some rain showers in the vicinity of Tagaytay and Laurel Batangas. Please like and share po. This is Inspire Life. Thank you very much for subscribing and watching. Have a beautiful day. Thank you.